How's it going guys and welcome back to ABTFM YouTube channel. Today we're back with another episode of the Zero to Hero. Welcome back to the series and in the last episode we actually played the um, game against Beijing in the Champions League group stage and then, uh, then proceed to play the other game. So this game against Beijing is actually a 2-0 loss however it still see us qualify to the uh, next round of the Champions League. So yeah we actually face Jiangsu. Yes we actually face the Chinese team again in the um, round of um, 16. I'm not uh, actually not round of 16. So the next Actually, maybe round of 16 or round of, um, let me just um, double check. So yeah, round of 16 right here against um, Jiangsu. And then, all right, we actually draw them nil-nil in the um, first leg. And then to be honest, this game, I actually went all out attack. My mentality was set at attacking. And then with a higher line of engagement, higher defensive line, and then just get stuck in long ball forward. I just want to go very, very aggressive. And in fact, let me just show you guys the match report right here. Of course, if you enjoy what you are seeing right now, kindly hit the thumbs up button and the subscribe button. Also turn on the bell to get notified so you wouldn't miss out any of my video. Yes, pushing towards 300 subscribers. And then a lot of you are watching the video and actually not subscribed to the channel. So yeah. Help me out and then just smash that um, subscribe button and I will, um, that would be very, very much appreciated. So anyway, let's see that. We have 17 shots, 5 on target, 1.5 XG. Oh my god, we are actually playing alright, but we still can't get the result. So um, the, 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 the plan of this series is actually just to reach the um, semi-final of the AFC Champions League with JDT because I don't think we actually have the squad depth to actually challenge for the Champions League. However, we at, in the last um, season, we actually exit in the round of 16 um, as well. Actually, no. Oh, we actually exit in the quarterfinal. Sorry. 2-2 draw against um, Guangzhou and then the second game we are just smashed by Guangzhou 8-0 man Guangzhou smashes 8-0 so this round against Jiangsu I actually don't know what to expect to be fair because the first leg is a nil nil and then today I am actually just going go all, all out with attacking again I just want to attack them I don't care I just want to attack I want to see um, what we can do because our squad today is actually not that great as well. You see that Safawi Rasid, our main man, is actually injured. And then our first choice left center back, Johar Rudin, is injured as well. I don't really have a very, very strong squad right now. And I'm actually playing Kadir, Rizwan Kadir, our region, right here at the left wing position. And then, I mean, Zazino and Fane will be still, still be playing as our two central midfielder. And then Abdul Rashid will be the left wing. Azizi, Ilam, and Hernandez will be playing as our two striker right here. And then our back line, we have to use Raja Amin. And then Muhammad Inshad right here and Davis. I mean, I don't know what to expect. So I'm just going to go in and attack the team. And hopefully we can get a good result. One away goal should be enough for us if we take a draw right there. Alright, so without further ado, let's jump straight into the game against Jiangsu. Alright, we are now in the game and um, I believe, yes, we are just going to play on key highlight and then let's see what we can do. As you can see right here, at mentality, attacking, and then I actually added um, get stuck in as well as uh, more direct passing against Jiangsu. Yes, I don't know what to expect. I literally don't know what to expect. Fazil with the loose ball, Fane, Hernandez, Raja Amin, pass it back to Fane, Kadir, and then Fane just hold the ball up and Hernandez with the... Oh! Oh my god, I mean, it's an offside, it's an offside. However, that was a very, very good attacking movement from us. Oh my god, I'm just going to demand more a little bit. We actually have three shots and Jiangsu have three shots as well. Actually, our XG is higher than Jiangsu. Oh my god. All right, Raja Amin brings out, bring the balls out and then pass it to Hernandez. Kadil right there, our region right here actually um, should be called Nugent. 
Yeah, our new gen right here. Replacing and what a ball from Sane! Uh, not Sane, sorry, Fane and Mohamed Azizi Ilam with the first goal. And it is what? It is a crucial away goal for us. So right now, if we can hold the lead, that will be perfect for us. A 1-0 win against Jiangsu will see us go through to the next um qualification. Um I mean next round of the AFC Champions League. Yes, I'm just going to point finger and say. I have faith in you. I have faith in you guys. So yes, let's just cause them an upset and then just go. Nine shots, one on target, 1.13 um, XG. It's brilliant. Come on, encourage the boys. Kadir actually running out of stamina. I'm just going into the... um To make some substitution right here. Kadir will come down and... Um, Bauru Hisham will actually come in. I, I got no one to use. And Fazil, I might need you to stay on the page because we actually don't have any... um. Defenders right here. Oh my god. All right, Abdul Rashid not doing well, but I don't think we have another winger I mean we can actually bring on Idris the um, another new gen is he's actually a striker However, he can play as a winger as well or maybe we'll move Azizi Ilam to here. Yes, let's just do that Let's just move Azizi Ilam to there. Actually, maybe not Azizi Ilam scored a goal So I'm just going to move Idris to play as the inverted winger on attack at the left side 1-0 come on Right now, 83 minutes. We have a throw in right there, but okay, long throw just doesn't work anymore. And I actually forgot to actually change it to a short um, throw in routine. So here we go. It's an attacking movement from Jiangsu, and that was a long range effort. However, they actually misses the target. Zinio pass it in. Oh my god, that's a great counter attack from um, Jiangsu, isn't it? How we end to Rodriguez, and Rodriguez scored. Oh. I mean, we actually have the away goal advantage right here. So let's just um, demand more from the boys. Come on, we actually have one shot on target. And that's a goal for us. And can the referee just blow the whistle right here? We can! And we are now through to the next round. Okay, I'm just gonna say people have written... Um, people, we actually prove people wrong. Let's go! Away goal sees Johor Darul Takzim, age through and we are going into the Champions League um quarterfinal I believe and then I don't remember who we are going to play in the next game oh we are actually going to play against Suwon oh we are actually playing against Suwon if I'm not mistaken we actually meet met Suwon in the first um in the first season right oh no it's actually Pohang oh my god we let me just um have a look at the um Quarterfinal? No, I am actually going to look at the second round right there. So Suwon actually win against Guangzhou. <laughs> All right, come on. We did not meet Guangzhou, but we are going to play against Suwon. Thanks, thank you, Suwon. Thank you very, very much. You actually beat Guangzhou right there, and I am very happy about that. And then let's just have a look at um the K League. See where um Suwon sits. Oh, actually, actually they are sitting at the fifth position. And then who else um? Let's just have a look at their key player. Oh my god, we actually can't because um we don't have that knowledge um in South Korea right there. However, yes, this is a brilliant win for us. A brilliant, brilliant win, provided that we actually don't really have our key player right there. Like Safawi Rasid actually injured, and then Raja Amin actually played it very well to step into the spot that um Johar Rudin was previously in. Very, very happy with the result. So, in the next game, I am just going to come back to play against Suwon in the second leg. Yes, it's an away game again. So, yeah, I think I'm just going to end this episode here. What a good game from us. And if you enjoy watching the content, make sure you hit the subscribe button, leave a like, leave a comment, share it to your friends. Also, don't forget to follow me on Twitter. It's abt underscore fm to join the discussion of football. Alright, and then that's all from me today. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.